Hey cronies, welcome back to our vlog. As you can see in the title below, this will be a small update of our boat. Short update. A short update of our boat. And to be honest, I am really nervous because we wasn't or weren't? Wasn't here. We wasn't here maybe one month now. And we heard that no, we, weren't. we weren't. See, we weren't here for almost one month, and we heard that there are people always on our boat because since we are waiting for the registrations papers, we cannot work with it. So the boat is here in Ubai outside of the water. Yeah, the fact is that we got an information that there's always guys on our boat overnight. Sometimes they sleep there, they do party there and we are scared that something is missing or they break something. So we make the plan now with Charmy's brothers that we will bring the boat back to Kandihai because it's too dangerous. So now it will be for us and it will be for us and for you the first update since months and I have no idea what is waiting for and I'm actually scared <sighs> this is our boat look guys this is not from us toilet is open By the way, this is actually something I just it's used. Are you sure? With poop? Yeah. This is actually something I don't like here in the Philippines that there are people. I understand that people are check the engines. This is something I don't like here, and I'm talking very straight now. This is something I really don't like here in the Philippines, that people show no respect to other people's property. And this is something I just explore here, as of now, since I'm born. When you're in Germany and there is something owned by someone else, okay? I say to Charmy, when, I mean, look, we have a big trouble, okay? And it's sometimes raining and you can see here is nothing around. Okay, so when the fishermen would just sit here on our boat because they are scared for the rain and they need to protect themselves, I have no problems with it. But guys, if you use someone else's property, show respect to it, you know? Make sure that when you leave it's clean, make sure that you don't break anything, yeah? Make sure that, that yeah, show respect to the people who give also trust to you. Because, I mean, it's not so, so crazy as I expected and I was scared that it will be way more worse. But the toilet is used. Um, there is stuff from other people. Now here is, look, here is trash now. That's mostly, it's not necessary, you know. And now we needed to drive from... Oh, there's a lot of water, right? Huh? Yeah, it's water. Okay, we need to put it out. Then here are clothes now. Yeah, the problem with the water is because of the here shots. Yeah, that's, that is um, natural. Yeah. But I want to... Can you um, I will get water here and you flush the dirty toilet? Because it's poop. It's yeah. stinky. I mean, they are here at the sea. Okay? So... For me, there should not be a problem that when you 
poop in the toilet that you walk 10 meters to get water to clean it. Or not? Or is it me who thinks wrong about this? I, I don't know. We are now making this um, temporary signage. It says that please, if you guys want to stay here, maintain cleanliness and make sure to take care that nothing will break or will be gone or something. <laughs> it's okay to stay here or sit down as long as you guys won't make it as you know where um everyone yeah like party place or something and no drinking to avoid accidents thank you for understanding and respecting the boat by owners and i hope nobody will take this wrong you know it's raining yeah we are waiting now when the rain stops we will give you a little update what we did and what we wanna do and then we will drive home but we this trapal there is also not from us so I don't know. <laughs> that one yeah ah that is the rest and I think my family there was a rest from this one mm. and then they just okay. make it yeah so we wanted to show you an update because there was some a lot of people asking what is with the bunker mm. and actually we are waiting and waiting and waiting to make a final episode to show you the final result but it takes us so many times now already and it takes you know, it takes us so much time now already that we had this feeling we will make you a vlog a little update so that you guys can see the boat still exists the boat is still okay um, yeah and hopefully maybe next week or in two weeks from now before we travel um, me and Charmy's brothers can bring the boat back to Kandihai because we have the feeling there is more safe yeah and the reason we came here guys is actually very unplanned it's just because we needed to drive here a little extra because we hear then that um you know some fishermen or people are staying here and making drinking i mean we are totally okay when people would sit here and you know talk with each other as long as they also respect the boat you know our property and because this is our considered money. our property and we invest so much and then we don't want that it will break or something because you know when you are drinking we cannot um, um some people cannot handle their s drunk self so we needed to come here and andre made a decision to make you know this note so when everyone can come here hopefully it will help and hopefully everyone will respect and to be honest i um thinking of ordering a camera to you know mm. like a hidden camera where this is very small so we can control even if we are abroad you can check it online and you can see if some someone is there and if something is is damaged we have someone to you know cut someone to catch and we will not accept that it will be just thank you yeah, that's the problem <laughs> Filipinos they always break anything yeah they always make something broken and then they always just say oh sorry yeah I'm sorry and for sorry is for them 
Ah, yeah, I, what I mean is sorry, you yeah. know. And then, you know, you stay there with something broken, broken properties mm. and everything, and then the only thing what you get is a sorry. You it's know? like you it's just say sorry to escape from, from the facts that yeah. you broke something. And, yeah. I really, really hope, guys, that the papers will just be done. You know, we have so many stress from this paper of this banka. It's unbelievable. It's really, really unbelievable. But we cannot do anything. We live in the Philippines where everything is slowed down. So, what should we do? Tomorrow, uh, in on Monday, we're going to go to um, Marine again to talk to people what we should do to make it finish because they said one week but now it's two months and we gave everything already we paid everything even the even the insurance of this boat are paid everything and yeah. still nothing we but cannot use the... it that's the problem we yeah. we pay so much money we pay insurance and we cannot even use anything so what's yeah. what's for so that's funny we paid the insurance two months ago it's always one year but now we pay insurance for a boat what cannot be used yeah. so we lost two months of our insurance already and we cannot use the boat yeah maybe you guys have some friends in Panglao who can help us you know we would really greatly appreciate that maybe you have some contacts in Panglao especially in Marina oh my god that would be amazing <laughs> it stopped raining so we will be so we are about to leave now but we wanted to show you some update uh, what we did so far what Charmy's family did so far uh, because there are some changings the first changing you can see here <laughs> we painted the bamboo it was black before but you know that there was all the black was removing and broke we have no idea exactly why but we realized that the white paint is the same brand, is the same. We mix it in the same way with thinner. We did everything the same, but the white one is way stronger in the salt water, I think. So, yeah, or well, maybe in the heat. So that's the reason why we painted this white now. So this is one of the big changings. Then we have one little problem. As you can see there. Um, when we made the final paint and we put the tape on the gold, unfortunately the gold removes while removing the scratch tape. Uh, this is a big problem because we have no gold paint anymore and this gold paint was mixed for us. So to get the exactly same mixture of the gold will be a problem. So this is something we need to find out how we will do it. Maybe you guys have an idea or we will paint it all complete one time gold so the color is the same. But this is something I need to discuss with Charmy's brothers. Yeah, and then you can see that we made the final painting of the body type. You can see it looks way more better now. And uh, the front here we painted also already. And now it's just the inside waiting. But, and this is the problem, we want to paint here the name. And we want to paint there the uh, company name. And also there we need to make our registration number, what we are waiting since months. So that's the reason why we are waiting now because we need to bring a painter to make the paintings and we want to do it all in one time so we don't need to have to ask him a couple times again and again because we always have to put the boat out and off of the water out and in and out okay. in and out of the water yeah that's the reason why it's staying still everything here now and 
So shots. Give our dear friends an update about your feeling about the boat, the current um, situation. I actually expect even worse than what I see now because like I said when I hear the news I was like oh my god maybe they are so drunk, they're scratching the paint, you know that's what I, my expectation but so far um, almost like nothing it's still maybe the because they said there's a lot of sand in the deck and because it was raining so hard so it flushed out the sand and I can also see that you know but yeah um, we still have things to do with the boat final retouch but I think we will do that once the papers is there because we this is our second time painting now but it's like nothing for nothing because we cannot make income with it because of the paper and we are too although the marina told us that we can operate the boat because they have the list of for those who made the who registered the boat but we are still too risky to take the risk no we are scared to take the risk so yeah now waiting no, waiting 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 <laughs> It's That's why some of you are asking about what is the what's happening now with the boat. We never hear the boat. It's because when we open the camera, we can just say the same thing as the last time we made. No. So nothing changes. And to be honest, if we didn't hear anything about the boat now that people are sitting here and sometimes drinking, we would not even come here. Guys, this was a short update of our boat vlog. And um, by the way, in the last few times we just uploaded like around 15 to 20 minutes vlogs not as before before we was always uploading um, 30 minutes or more let us know in the comments if this is a time it's okay or do you want to have longer vlogs or more vlogs but shorter it would be good for us to have a feedback what kind of vlogs you prefer because of because of course we want to make these vlogs entertaining and good for you. Um, yeah. So we are going to drive home and my Sawa, she's a little bit moody because she's hungry. So we will try to find food. Uh, I eat rice with sardines. <laughs> my only one go, rice and sardines. <laughs> Let us say bye. Bye cronies and thank you so much for watching our vlogs. And like always, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye-bye.